Hi folks, Canadian Prepper here. So I gotta provide some background to this video. These two videos that you see here on the screen were videos I've made in the last three months. They're both reviews of two different flashlights. Now it's come to my attention that people have been stealing this footage and putting it in their product advertisements. Every other week now I'm getting a message from a subscriber or a follower on Instagram who is telling me that, hey, I seen your footage being used in somebody else's advertisement and lo and behold I go and I look at the ad and sure enough there's some company masquerading their really cheap crap flashlight product and splicing in bits of my footage to mislead their customers into thinking that uh, their product has that kind of capability now what pisses me off the most about this is the complete disregard for the consumer you are basically outright trying to deceive the consumer to making a dollar. So these guys are all about the one hit wonder. They're all about, you know, taking people's money once and that's it. Because they know when people do eventually get the product and it breaks down in a week or it doesn't perform nearly as well as they're depicting in the footage that they've stolen, they know these people are not going to come back and they're basically going to be suckered in. So you need to be very careful when you see these advertisements on Facebook. Facebook in particular because they really have no scruples when it comes to advertisements. Unless you're a company like myself uh, who basically has had their Facebook ads disabled because apparently I'm selling dangerous stuff. So, you know, of course it's life-saving stuff, but they view it uh, the other way. Yet these companies these dime a dozen uh, marketing firms or whatever can come on here and steal people's footage and totally mislead customers about their products and they're given free reign and you see this stuff everywhere and it's not just flashlights anytime you see those fast motion ads on Facebook watch them closely because chances are they've stolen footage from somebody else from some legitimate product and they basically just spliced it into their own. You see it with the indestructible, uh, waterproof shoes. Lots of things in the camping and survival genre are getting passed off in this way because they know now it's becoming mainstream, but they know that a lot of people have very little clue as to the difference between a quality product and a product which is not quality. This is particularly disturbing because these are items that people may use in survival situations. So you're deceiving somebody into thinking that the product they're purchasing has a certain capability which their life may actually rely on at some point. To me, that's just the lowest of the low. Now, I'm not upset even because they use my footage. It, it, that's not really what upsets me about this at all. It's the fact that people can be so blatantly dishonest. And I know the world is not a fair place. When you're like myself and you're trying to do business the right way the fair way to make sure that people are getting high quality gear that's going to take care of you in the field and you're not going to be cursing out my name when the thing that you purchased off my website uh, didn't work the whole point is to provide you with gear which is going to last you're much better off in my opinion buying once and crying once so all of these uh, flashlight screenshots that you see here these are products that we actually sell at CanadianPreparedness.com and yes they're gonna be far more expensive than the cheap knockoff pieces of crap which are being sold uh, on Facebook but that's the price that you have to pay for quality and that's part of the reason why I started my store in the first place so I can help combat this tsunami wave of rebranded substandard unreliable junk that's providing people a false sense of confidence which may well mean the difference in a life or death situation. So what I recommend you would do, if you see videos like this, scrutinize them. If you find anything that doesn't stand out right, make sure you leave a comment and express yourself publicly about it. And maybe these guys will stop doing it. You can even report the ads uh, to Facebook. The more people that do that, the less and less they're going to get away with this. Because of the pervasiveness of these ads, this tells me that this is a marking strategy that works. Otherwise, they wouldn't do it. And that means that there's a lot of people getting ripped off. Once again, this isn't about me being overly protective of my footage. If a company wants to use my footage uh, for an ad, as long as they're being honest with their customers, 
Typically, I won't have a problem with it for the most part, unless they're being downright exploitative and they're making money hand over fist. And obviously, you know, we'd be having a bit of a discussion about that. But as long as a company that's using my information has at their core the intent to actually help people get prepared, I'm really okay with that. It's people like this who just want to make a quick buck. And these guys are a dime a dozen in this industry right now. The sharks are out in this preparedness industry right now and always do your research before buying things go on youtube see what the gear reviewers are saying you know feel free to drop me a message either on facebook or through email or through my store's website ask me if you know i think a product is good and i'll give you an honest opinion like most gear reviewers on here within our small preparedness community will chances are if you can find a review on a product Unless it's brand new, then, you know, chances are it's probably not that good or it's just a bunch of rebranded nonsense. So when you see these ads, make sure that you flag them, report these ads, report these scammers so that less people get burned down the road. Thanks for watching. Canadian Prepper out. The best way to support this channel is to support yourself by gearing up through CanadianPreparedness.com. We've totally revised our website, we only deal with quality products at the best prices, and all of my subscribers get a VIP discount of 10% off the entire store. Use discount code SURVIVALPREPPER for 10% off. Don't forget the strong survive and the prepared thrive. See you next time.